Junior running back Mike Mayhew was the bright spot in what was otherwise a very dim night for the North Carolina a and football team. Bethune-Cookman's Matt Johnson scored on a 28-yard run within the first two minutes of the game. However, they failed to score with the extra point. In just four plays, Bethune was able to make their way back down the field with the five-yard touchdown by running back Isidore Jackson. Two minutes later, Isidore Jackson would score again, this time on a two-yard run, making the score 19-0. While lining up for the extra point, the lights in the stadium shut off, a transformer blue causing nearly a one-hour, 40-minute delay in the game. When the game resumed, Bethune kicked the extra point to increase their lead to 20 nothing. A&T finally got on the board. Mayhew had two 21-yard carries on a four-play drive that ended with a four-yard Ricky Lewis touchdown, bringing the game to 27. Bethune-Cookman continued to score, however. The Wildcats followed up the Aggies' drive with the 11-play drive that ended in an Andros Bell touchdown. An interception by Wildcat linebacker Ryan Davis returned possession to the Wildcats as they took over at the Aggies' 10-yard line. Isidore Jackson gave the Wildcats their fifth score with the one-yard touchdown that put Bethune in front, 32-7. A&T's Dominique Drake ran the ball from one yard out to give the Aggies another touchdown, making it 32-14. Sullivan Schittler had a 31-yard field goal, adding three points to the board for the Aggies. Unfortunately, that wasn't enough. Aggies trail, final score, 67-17. I am Ashley Washington with your Aggie Sports Report.